We have been learning about facts and jokes. We would like to present our songs, our jokes, and our readers to you. The first graders of the Golden Group would like to perform The Little Green Frog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Their tails are even smaller. 
They have shed their tadpole skin and lips. At last, they have the wide mouth of frogs. The tadpoles have become tiny frogs. They climb out of the pond and onto the land. Their tails would become tiny frogs. They climb out of the pond and onto the land. Oh, I read your part. <laughs> Uh -oh. Their tails will become smaller and smaller until they finally disappear. The tiny frogs begin to eat insects, worms, and they, they aren't vegetarians anymore. Frogs are amphibians. The word amphibian comes from a Greek word that means to lie. An amphibian can live on land or in the water. Frogs are cold-blooded. That means their inside body temperatures are about the same as the outside temperature. During the next few years, the tiny frogs will grow to be miniature frogs. Then they will be able to make their own frog spot, and there will be new baby frogs. Frogs have many body parts. Skin, back leg, five toes, web feet, ear, eyes, nostrils, teeth, front leg, toes, tongue. The tongue is attached to the front of the mouth. This is sticky. Frog don't hunt for food. Their big eyes are on top of their heads so they can see all the way around. They stay very still when something flies or crawls nearby. Their long, sticky tongue darts out to catch it. They swallow their food whole. Frogs that swim <coughs> use their powerful hind legs and webbed feet to push them through the water. Frogs have two sets of eyelids. One set is transport so they can see through them. When frogs dive, they close these eyelids to protect their eyes. On land, the frogs hop above. They use their very strong hind legs to leap. Most frogs can leap ten times their body length. They are wonderful jumpers. Oh. <laughs> Keep going. There are differences between the, between frogs and toads. Frogs have small teeth in their upper jaw. Toads don't have teeth. Frogs have large round ear membranes. Toads have small round ear membranes. Frogs have ridges on their back and toads have ridges on their head. Frogs have a narrow body. Toads have plump bodies. Frogs have a smooth, moist, soft skin. Toads have thick, bumpy, thick, dry, bumpy skin. Frogs have long, tiny legs and have long leaves. Toads have short legs. They move slowly with short leaves. Frogs like clumps of eggs in water. Toads lay their eggs in strings. Frogs live in or near water, and toads live on land. Crow, crow, crow. Frogs lived 230 million years ago, even before dinosaurs lived on Earth. An um, African bullfrog can be as big as a football. Frogs protect gardens by eating loud. Large amounts of insects. Some people eat frog legs, which they consider a 
don't delicacy. A drop of frog candy, 100 mosquitoes in one night. Frogs have different kinds of feet. Some have sticky toes for climbing. Some have painted toes for digging. Others have webbed feet for swimming. Some tree frogs spend their entire life in tree tops and never come down to the ground. The glass frog has strained skin. You can see through the skin to its insides. Some very big frogs can eat mice and rats. Some species of frogs are becoming extinct. Herpetologists are trying to find out what is causing this. We must learn to take better care of life on our planet. Now when in the neighbor has some more humor for us. What happens if a frog parks on a yellow line? I don't know, Lydon. What happens if a frog parks on, a, on double yellow lines? He gets towed away. Where do baby frogs learn to swim? I don't know. Avery, where do baby frogs learn to swim? In a tad pool. What does a frog order in a restaurant? I don't know, Lady. What does a frog order in the restaurant? French fries and diet croak. So first grade is going to go to the program. Read Frog and Toad Spring as written by uh, Anna Global. Frog ran up the path to Toad's house. He knocked on the front door. There was no one. Toad, Toad, wake up! It is spring. Blah. Toad, Toad, the sun is shining. The snow is melting. Wake up! I am not here. Frog, Frog walked into the house. It was dark. All the shutters were closed. Toad, where are you? Go away. Toad was lying in bed. He pulled all the covers over his head. Frog pushed Toad out of bed. He pushed him out of the house and onto the front porch. Toad blinked in the bright sun. Help! I can't see anything. Don't be silly. What you see is the clear warm light of April. And it means that we can begin a whole new here together. Toad, think of it. We will skip through the meadows and run through the woods and swim in the river. In the evenings, we will sit right here in the front porch and count the stars. Toad went back into the house. He got into the bed and pulled the covers over his head. But, but Toad, you will miss all the fun.
Toad looked at the calendar. The main page was on top. Toad climbed out to bed to look. Why, it is May. Then he and Frog ran outside to see how the world kept, was looking in the spring. That's the other first students who read the story that why not stop. This story of the wide mouth. This is the story of the wide mouth frog. One day, the little wide mouth frog said to his mother, "Mama, what do wide mouth frogs eat? Why don't you go ask some of our neighbors?" Okay, ribbit. So then he went to Mr. Bear and said, "Mr. Bear." What do your cubs eat? My cubs eat berries and leaves and so such. Okay, ribbit. So then he went to Mrs. Giraffe and said, Mrs. Giraffe, what do your babies eat? Oh, why my babies eat grass and leaves and such. Okay, ribbit. So then the young white mouth frog went to Mr. Elephant and said, Mr. Elephant, what do your babies eat? Well, grass and they love a good peanut. Okay, ribbit, ribbit. So then he went to Mr. Alligator and said, Excuse me, Mr. Alligator, what do your babies eat? Why, our babies eat one of the rocks. Oh, okay. Now Sam and I have some jokes to share with you. What does a frog like to sing? I don't know, Sam. What does a frog like to sing? Opera. Why do frogs, why are frogs normally so happy? I don't know, Ellie. Why are frogs normally so, why are frogs so happy? They eat whatever bugs them. Which frogs can jump higher than a house? I don't know. Which frogs can jump higher than a house? All of them. A house can't jump. The second graders will now sing the song Froggy Grows Up. Froggy is a floating in a big old pond.
second readers of the Valley Group will now read an African folk tale called How Far With Heaven. Begin. There once was a young man named Kimon. He wanted to marry the sky man. He wrote a letter to her father, the sun chief. I, Kimana, man of earth, want to marry the sky maiden, your daughter. Kimana went to Rada. Will you take this letter? I can't go to Rada. Kimana went to Antelope. Can, will you take this letter? I cannot go to heaven. Kimana went to Hawk. Will you take this letter? I can go halfway, but I can not go to heaven. Then Frog came to Kimana. Why do you not take the letter yourself? This I cannot do. Then I will do it for you. Ha ha no laugh. Ha ha ha. Can a frog take a letter to heaven? Whatever it is, I can do it, but only if I try. Now frog lived by a well. Every day, the girls who served the sun sheep came to this world. They climbed down from heaven on a web made by spiders. Then they filled their water just in one home. Frog put the water in his mouth and hid in the well. The girls from heaven came for water, singing their song. Good day to you, my sister. Good day to you. They lowered their jugs into the well, and Frog jumped into it. The girls did not see. The sun chief came for a drink of water. He saw the letter and opened it. He read, I command a man of earth wish to marry this guy made in your daughter. How can this be? He, he went to his he went to the girls who fetched water. Did you open this letter? We did not. He went to his wife, the old lady, and read it to her. What should we do? Don't ask me, ask my daughter. He went to his daughter, the sky made and said, let us see if he can bring a wedding gift. So the sun chief wrote a letter and sent it on the bench. Rob came out and put the letter in his mouth, then he climbed into an empty jug. The next day, the girls took their jugs and climbed down to earth singing their song. have to stop. We did not. He went to his wife, the old lady, and read it to her. What should we do? Don't ask me. Ask the daughter. He went to his daughter. The sky made and said, let us see if he can bring a wedding gift. So the sun chief wrote a letter and set it on the bench. And then he went away. Rock came out and put the letter in his mouth, then he climbed into an empty jug. The next day, the girls took the jug and climbed after a singing their song. Good day to you, my sister. Good day to you. They lowered their jugs into the well, and Frog jumped out. Then the girls went back to heaven. Frog took the letter to Kimari. Kimari read it. You may marry my daughter if you bring me. If you bring a purse of money. This I cannot do. Then I will do it for you. Ha ha ha. You took a letter to heaven. You 
But you can, but can you bring a purse of money? Whatever it is, I can do it, but only if I try. Kimana gave Froggy a purse of money. Frog took hold of it with his mouth and carried it to the well. He climbed in and waited. Girls from heaven, the girls from heaven came to the wall. Good day to you, my sister. Good day to you. Frog got into one of the jugs. The girls returned to the heaven and left him in the room. Frog set the money on the bench and then he hid. The sun chief came and found the purse. How can this be? He went to the girls. Did you bring this money? We did not. He went to his wife. The old lady said, Don't ask me. Ask your daughter. He went to his daughter. Let us see if he can come fetch me. So the sun chief wrote a letter and left it on the bench. Frog put the letter in his mouth. He climbed into an empty job. The next day, the girls carried him to earth. Good day to you, my sister. Good day to you. <coughs> he jumped back into the wall and the girls went back to heaven. Frog walked over to took him out. You may marry my daughter if you come and fetch her. This I cannot do. Then I will do it for you. Ha ha ha. You took a letter to heaven. You brought a purse of money. But can you fetch a bride? Whatever it is, I can do it. But only if I try. Frog climbed back into the world. The girls came with their jugs. Good day to you, my sister. Good day to you. They carried him to heaven. Frog jumped out. He spit in all the jumps of water. Then he hid in an empty jug. The people at the house came and drank the water. They all got sick. <coughs> the sun chief called for the spirit doctor. The doctor told him, You promised your doctor to a man of earth, but she has not gone. He has sent an evil spirit with a sickness. The evil spirit is in the shape of a frog. The sun chief went to his wife. The moon lady said, Don't ask me, ask your daughter. He went to his daughter, the sky maiden, and said, I will go. The next day, the sky maiden went to the girls down to the well. Good day to you, my sister. Good day to you. Girls fill their jumps and Frog jumped out. The girls left the sky <coughs> and they went home. Frog jumped out of the well. <coughs> I will lead you to your husband. Sky man is wild. <laughs> Can a frog lead a woman? I brought a letter to heaven. I brought a purse of money, I fetched a bride, whatever it is, I could do it, but only since I tried. Then it is you I will marry. She took her back to heaven and married him. They went on and on. And she wanted to wait for a bride. <laughs> <laughs> the first squares will, will read with excitement. A story written by Otto Lobo. It is titled Frog, uh, Frog and 
told a swim. Toad and Frog went down to the river. What a day for a swim. Yes, I'll go behind the truck to put on my bathing suit. I don't wear a bathing suit. Well, I do. After I put on my bathing suit, you must not look at me until I get into the water. Why not? Because I look funny in my bathing suit. That is why. Frog closed his eyes when Toad came out from the behind rocks. Toad was wearing his bathing suit. Don't be. Frog and Toad jumped into the water. They they swam all night. Toad swam slowly and made small splashes. A turtle came along the river bank. Frog, tell the to turtle to go away. I do not want him to see me in in my bathing suit when I come out of the river. Frog swam over to the turtle. Turtle, you will have to go away. Why not? Because Toad thinks he looks funny in his bathing suit and he does not want you to see him. Some lizards were sitting nearby. Why would a frog go 
to a hospital. I don't know where my one frog go to a hospital to have a operation. How do the frogs feel about the way we treat our planet? I don't know. How do frogs feel about the way we treat the planet? They are happy mad. <laughs> Ten, the first graders will now sing 10 Little Speckled Frogs. Ten Little Speckled Frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum! One jumped into the pool. Say!